The white goat of rap is back flying his fighter jet into the entire rap game. Elon Musk gets high with Joe Rogan. The queen and the empress add another layer of bullshit to their bullshit. Welcome Hold to- on, sweetness. You want to add something, Angelo? You can't just skip over the fact that we've got a brand new look. The good folks at Torch Up NYC stepped up their fucking game. That's right, Angelo. New studio, new graphics, and you promised to have a new attitude. That's correct, douchebag. But you forgot to mention the producers also redrew us. You don't look like Lester Holtz no more. You're glowing. What does that mean? You know, your, your skin is shining. You're glowing. You're like a pregnant bitch. Angelo. Why? That's a compliment. Angelo, your phone. Oh, fuck. Pick it up. Who is it? It's Keisha. Your wife, Keisha. Pick it up. My girlfriend. The pain in my potato croquettes. <clears throat> Hello, honey. Angelo, what did I tell you about leaving the pot on the stove? Every time you make pork and beans, you leave the leftovers on the stove. I walk in the apartment, and it smells like Nathan's had a fight with the porta potty Keisha. at a Tony Bennett's concert. Keisha, I'm at work. I'm sorry. I'll clean it when I get home. Wait. Am I on the air? Yes, Keish. Oh, hi, Barney. Hey, Keish. I love your new look. Tell your wife we should do lunch next week. I'll drive up to Chappaqua. Bye, Keisha. You just hung up on your wife. Shut up. My girlfriend. And she was done. And you eat pork and beans for breakfast? Hey, hey! Go fuck yourself. Sunday, September 8th, 2018. My name is Barney Calvin. And I'm Angelo Antonio Francesco. Welcome to This Week in Bullshit News. The self-titled rap god is back at it. This past week, Eminem dropped a surprise album entitled Kamikaze, where he seemingly dissed mumble rappers including Lil Yachty, Lil Pump, Lil Xan, Lil Wayne, Lil Dicky, Lil B, Lil Uzi, Lil John, Lil Mama, Lil Scrappy, Lil Debbie. I'll tell you what Lil he didn't diss, Lil Fame from M.O.P., Motherfucker would have blew his brains out. Brooklyn? This past week, owner of Tesla and SpaceX, Elon Musk, met with comedian and UFC commentator Joe Rogan on his super popular podcast, The Joe Rogan Expedition. Angelo, it's Elon Musk, not must. Whatever. And it's the Joe Rogan experience. It's the Joe Rogan experiment until I'm on that shit. Anyways, Joe Rogan had Musty take a pull from a blunt. Not only did his stock instantly drop, but Musty said the shit had no effect. I'll tell you why. Because he didn't fucking inhale. He built Clinton that shit. Let's watch. I mean, it's legal, right? It's totally legal. Okay. How does that work? Do people get upset at you if you do certain things? There's uh, tobacco and marijuana in there. That's all it is. The, the combination of tobacco and marijuana is wonderful. Joe, you didn't catch that? And what the fuck did you mean by this? So that's like... That's like some superhero type shit. You know? You wouldn't want to be Spider-Man. You'd rather just sleep tight in Gotham City. I hope he's out there doing his job. Spider-Man in Gotham City? Two separate worlds, dickhole. The queen of rap... Nicki Minaj was approached by the Empress Cardi B at the Harper's Bazaar Icons party. Apparently, Cardi left with a torn dress and a lump above her eye. That shit ain't nothing. My Puerto Rican friends call it a coco tasso. Cardi's a gangster. Should be alright. Oh, 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 Barney. Before we go off air, I have a fan video director told you. Oh, awesome. Greg, let's play the video. How's it going? This is Truth the Barber Artist, and I got a question for Barney Calvin. I've heard of bowl cuts where you got the line going around the head, but how did you manage to make a bowl hairline? What'd you do? You put a bowl on your face and you traced it? That's a round hairline. How'd you pull it off? 
He said you shave with a cereal bowl on your mug, you piece of shit. <clears throat> for, for CWBSN, my name is Barney Calvin. And as always, truth, the barber artist can kiss my uppity black ass. Why don't you come on this show and say it to my face? Oh, <laughs> my